Good morning. You're listening to FloorDaily.net, and I'm Kim Parr. This morning, my guest is Bill Borer, who's president with Wall to Wall Flooring in Idaho. Bill, how you doing? Good. How are you, Kim? I'm great. I saw you in Dallas this past weekend at the Mohawk Show, and we didn't get a chance to talk then, but you agreed to talk to me now. You're still on the road, so it sounds like you're more of a road warrior than I am. I think so. I haven't been home yet. I came from the Mohawk convention to a Mondo athletic show in uh, Orlando, so that's where I am right now. Well, at least you're beating that cold weather down there, right? It's been very cold in Idaho, yeah. and uh, it's in the. It was like seventy-eight at lunch yesterday, so I'm, I may not go home. <laughs> okay. Well, let's tell our listeners a little bit about wall to wall. I know that you know when it comes to flooring retailers in Idaho, you're you're one of the biggest. I know you have three retail stores. Tell us a little bit of background on wall to wall, if you would. We we basically have two companies, a retail and a commercial company. The retail is a third-generation family business, and we have three large retail stores in eastern Idaho and then one in Ogden, Utah. They're big stores. We inventory rolls of carpet and, and other uh, residential products. The commercial company was started in 1989, and that's uh, done very well also. We have two additional uh, locations, Boise, Idaho, and Salt Lake City, where we just do commercial and not residential. Yeah, actually, I've got to point out that I know you the best from the fact that you're not only a member of Starnet, but you've been on the board with Starnet, right? That's right. Starnet's a terrific organization. Right. So you wear two hats, yeah, involved in both sides of the business. Okay, so just overall business conditions in Idaho, I'm sure that as we went through this recession, there was probably some effect, but it wasn't as severe in Idaho as in other areas, was it? You know, in eastern Idaho, I, it was as severe. Oh, it was. And okay. it, it's still somewhat severe. Eastern Idaho, and now I'm talking residentially, yeah. really hasn't emerged strongly from this recession. Our Utah operation has. Utah is doing much better, but no, that recession hit hit Idaho pretty hard. Western Idaho, Boise, and unfortunately we don't have a a residential operation out there. Boise is doing very, very well, that market. It's come back. So we're hoping that Eastern Idaho follows suit this year, 2014. Now, not to get too much into details about your business, but as you look at, say, performance in 13 versus 12, we think nationwide that the residential business might have grown 7% or so. Did your business grow that well? Yeah, I think we're about 10 or 12% up in our Utah store, and we're pretty flat in the two eastern Idaho stores. Let's shift over to the Mohawk Solutions meeting. I believe this is the third time you've been to one of these. So the fact that you went to that, I guess, tells me that you're either a color center or a floorscapes. What's the situation there? We're a Mohawk Color Center dealer, and we've been one for for many years. I, I can't even remember how long. It's a very good program, and we're very happy with it. Yeah, so you were there, and you heard many of the things that I heard. But as you think about the things that you saw in Dallas, what are the couple of takeaways that caught your eye? Well, first of all, I was very impressed with Mohawk, how well organized they were. Their entire residential presentation, they have their act together, and I was very impressed I think two specific things that caught my eye. Uh, One is their new PET carpet. I believe they're calling it Continuum, but they've come up with a patented process, and the PET fibers are stronger and thicker, so the carpet gives you a much bigger, nicer feel than standard PET, and yet you get all the benefits plus of it. Uh, One of the main benefits is is it comes from recycled bottles, and so it's a very uh, good environmental product. The second thing is, is Mohawk has a five-star program where they're using the internet and helping their dealers get leads and manage their reputation online. And I'll tell you, I think we have a very good website, but it's not interactive enough. And you just don't have time to keep it up like a bigger organizations do. We're going to take this on, I believe. We haven't decided fully to do it, but it is something that we will definitely be able to use and it's something that we definitely need. So. Yeah, I listened to some of that presentation, and they were pointing out that 90% plus of every homeowner before they buy carpet start on the Internet. And this whole five-star program they're offering is a way of making sure that you're seen in that search process and also managing your reputation. They are firm believers that the best way to convince a consumer to buy 
is to have a testimonial from another happy customer. Right. And so this reputation management thing they're talking about is making sure that, first, that there are comments out there, and secondly, that the comments are positive and, and helpful, right? Exactly. And then if we get a bad comment, we're notified. Well, we're notified of all comments, but there's a bad one. They will help you call that customer and find out what the problem was. And if there really was a problem, it gives us the opportunity to improve ourselves. And a lot of times these things are a misunderstanding or there's something that we should have done that we can correct. So it's a heck of a lot better to call that customer that may have given you a bad mark and do what we can to make it better. And and overall, that helps your overall reputation uh, to, to be able to do that as opposed to you don't even know that that came through and you don't even know that that customer was unhappy with you. And another key part of it is that as either a Floorscapes or Color Center dealer, if somebody's searching for product, they bring a lot of traffic to you. So that's a plus and I guess a reason for being part of that, right? Yes, absolutely. People are going to go to the Mohawk website before they're going to go to ours. They're looking for carpet, they're going to go to Mohawk. And then those inquiries get passed on to Mohawk dealers in the respective markets. So I think we'll get a lot of lead generation that we wouldn't get just working off our own website. Bill, well, I appreciate you spending time with us again. It was good to catch up with you in Dallas, and I hope you have safe travels back and a Merry Christmas. Again, we've been talking to Bill Borer, who's president with Wall to Wall in Idaho, and you've been listening to Kempar and FloorDaily.net.